Hey everyone, Chris McKee here, General Sales Manager at the Hitch House. Today I'm standing in front of one of the best motorhomes for a family we've seen in a long time. This is the 220 XG Leprechaun by Coachman. Let's take a peek, shall we? So, starting at the front here, we have a rounded front cap that helps to cut down on whistling, front cap leaks. Um, any number of things that uh, or water penetration it cuts down on all of that. It also creates a quieter ride Moving up something so simple. I don't understand why everyone doesn't do it is a rain gutter guys I started off washing these things and the amount of black streaks that will eliminate in time. It'll save you is You can't measure it. it's it's that much time You have running boards on the Ford chassis You have your power you have your power awning that's underlit at the coach. You have your propane, all integrated. Guys, when you pick up, this is full. Every motorhome we deliver, full propane, full of fuel. You have an outside exterior outlet for solar, so if you have some panels, you can plug them into there. Asdale sidewalls, vacuum bond and construction. It's a well-built coach. Hot water heater, furnace, all easily accessible. We'll see that inside. New graphics package for 2024 as well. I say that this is our first year with the product and we are extremely impressed with what we've seen so far, guys. So back here, this was one of the things that got me excited as well. For those who like the tailgate country music festivals or any music festivals for that matter, this is not for a satellite. This is coming in from the antenna on the roof. So you can put your TV here. You can watch the Leafs, uh, you know, uh, kick the uh, Montreal Canadiens up and down the ice if you'd like. You have power for the TV. Here, if you have a Blackstone, barbecue, anything like that, an exterior griddle, you have your outside propane connection all ready to go. Come on around back and we'll see one of the coolest features of this guy. Right here. Guys, this is a massive rear entry. Now, what that does is, number one, allows for an extra emergency exit. Number two, it allows you to carry some extra toys with you. Come on, take a peek at this. So you have four tie downs structured right into the framing of the coach. So you could put any bicycles back there. You could put a small Enduro motorcycle. And uh, guys, this is a motorhome after my own heart. You know, you get one bike in here, you get a buddy's bike on the rear hitch. Two of you, two main sleeping areas. This, this is just money if you're out on for into adventure riding. Now, you have a backup camera back there. And again, just a shot with the door closed. License plate down there, LED rear tail lights. And again, it's the little things that make the difference, guys. This rear bumper is Rhino Line. So it just helps add an extra bit, you know, layer of durability while you're stepping on and off it or things are rubbing up against it. You're not going to end up with those rust marks or scratching the paint that's going to annoy you. Coming along the driver's side of the coach, what we have here is your exterior storage compartment. This here is a ladder for the bunk, comes with the coach. And this is, and that's all rotocast with a one-way drain valve, so you can get even get the garden hose out, wash it out, it's just gonna drain it at the bottom. Again, we, we, you know I love talking about the poop department. You have your gray for gray, black for black, guys, it's keeping it simple. It's what it's all about with this. You store your sewage hose right in there and away you go. So, rear refrigerator access. Other than that, it's nice and simple. You have your uh, magnum energy inverter right here. So that's your, your uh, refrigerator in this is strictly electric so you can turn the inverter on and off as you, as you wish. If you're driving down the road and want to have the refrigerator running. We'll go into more, more of that inside. Steer your shower. Guys, again, our paws, the dog's paws, we're filthy. It's just, a, you know, do yourself a favor, wash your feet off before you go inside. It'll uh, make the missus a lot more happy. So come on over here. We have certain, um, you have a black tank rinse, or sorry, tank flush. What you're gonna have is cable input as well, another tank flush, and then your city water connection, all right here. Coming up to the front, Guys, they call it an entry level, but there's no corners cut here. Onan, the name of the name. So that's what we have here is the Onan 4000. Onan's the same generator 
as this $1.5 million bus behind me. It's the exact same company, different size of generator, but again, the quality is still there. And again, Ford E350 chassis. We love the Ford chassis here. It's got that 7.3 Godzilla in it. It's the same motor that's in our 40 foot gas motorhomes, guys. It's, it's an absolute workhorse. Just for aesthetically, we have those front cap lights, which you can turn on and off. Guys, you know, if you've had a couple cocktails at the neighbor's campsite, you turn those on before you come home, kind of helps you to find your way. Come on in. Welcome to the inside of the Leprechaun 220 XG, guys. I'm sitting in my, probably the most favorite spot in, in, in this, which is the driving seat, but unlike most small C classes, these seats turn around. Why? Because you have an L-shaped lounge here that just allows you to have a beautiful conversation area now. You don't get that in many small C-classes. And another thing that I like about this unit is one, two, three, excuse me, four, five seat belts, guys. Five, including a child safety tether right here in the floor. What that means is you can bring, you can now bring the real little ones along with you in a nice safe configuration, uh, heading back up to, well, now, you know, where's everyone gonna sleep in this? Well, we have a forward bunk here that holds up to 800 pounds. You have a big wide screen, 40 inch TV. You have extra storage under the headrests. USB charging down there. This breaks down into a big, big sleeping area, again, for the size of the motorhome. What you do? Could be easier. This comes out. And now you have a U-shaped dinette. So that this table will break down into a bed. And I'm sure we can have some magic off camera to show you what that looks like. Coming back to the rear bathroom. Again, guys, six foot 250. I'm losing a little weight now, but uh, you know. So again, I got room to work. Very comfortable. You can do what you need to do. Sit here, shave, anything like that. Get ready for the get ready for a night on the town. So now everyone's been looking at what's behind me right here. This is the, the toy area for when you're driving, or obviously the bed area. And we're just going to show you how easy that is. So you've got to your campsite, you've taken out the bicycles. And guys, it's just this easy. You're now ready for sleeping for five to six people. You, you know, you want to have somebody meet you at the campsite, that's six people. Other than that, you got five you got people comfortable sleeping for five people, guys. Five seatbelts, five people. And it's just that easy to put the the bed up, guys. Get a little more storage above here. And I'm gonna show you this fridge because this fridge is real neat. So, obviously just electric powered fridge. You turn it on and off right here. So, if you're coming in from the uh, campsite, get a drink. Obviously that's pretty straightforward, but you can come in through the back as well. And it opens the other way. So that just saves on that extra you know, bit of dirt in the motorhome cuts down on that. Freezer, same deal. So moving up here, we are at rooftop AC. It's not ducted in a coach this size, guys. It doesn't need to be. This is a very small, wide open area. So it's very easy to cool or heat if you need to. Moving on to that, let's get to the kitchen. So you have convection microwave down here. You have a three burner range top right here. Folds out of the way. Storage right up here. Guys, for this is huge for a small motorhome. You have your exterior power right here, or sorry, extra power. So you have 120 USB C, USB. Guys, look at that. That's pots, pans, toaster oven, anything you want. Anything your imagination desires can fit right in there. 
Again, moving into more storage. They've really maximized the space in this. And the counter, again, it's usable. You have your sink down low. It's big enough that you want to put some dishes in. You can do that. You can have, a, you know, you prepare some meals right here or on the table right here. And then on top of all that, you have a massive wardrobe right here. Now guys, this is early January, 2024 when we're filming this. We have two of these that can be ready for March break this year. That's all we have. This was a special deal from Coachman. We're honored to have them. But once they're gone, I won't be able to have them in time for March break after that. So if you have any interest in this, give us a call, 705-722-0008. We'd be happy to go over some figures with you. These are an incredible value. This is the most value C-Class we've seen in probably seven or eight years here. So again, Chris McKee from the Hitch House. I'm the General Sales Manager. Thank you, and we'll see you soon.